Hi everybody, it's Kari and I just got my first shipment of prints in, shipped to me, and I wanted to share with you some of the options and what they look like so you know and you can see what the papers and the canvases and the metals look like. And I'll tell you some, some ideas if you're not sure what to order when you wanna order a print. The first option I have is the matte paper, and this is really good paper, and I'm really impressed with the color and the quality of it. It's thick paper, doesn't have a shine to it, which is good if you wanna put this under glass. And that's what you're going, I'm gonna recommend, is you're gonna to have to put this under um, a frame with glass in it to protect it. But this is a really, really nice option, and it's pretty easy on the budget. You then would have to bring it to a framer or have a frame ready for it. So something that's very kind of unique, shaped like this long rectangle, you're gonna to have to custom frame it. Or right on the website, it's a, a really good deal. You can get this matted, any color mat that you want, and then you can also get it framed. And there are many, many choices of frames of different colors and different styles. Um, and you could get it framed and it would be ready to hang on your wall as soon as you opened it up. And then the next paper I have is the watercolor paper. And I got this option just to have a little bit different variety and the, still have the paper prints. Like the difference between the two papers is this one's thicker and it has a, a tooth texture to it. So I don't know if you can see in the white areas here, there's, there's um, the bumps and that's just gonna give it a little more texture type of look to it. The colors again are great and um, it needs to be framed, matted and framed. And if you wanna just put it into a frame without matting it, then the, you can order it with the border on here and it would still look really, really nice. The, the something like this with the rectangle size, some of these do come in sizes that are um, standard frame sizes. So just you know, make sure you have a frame, measure it, or order a frame that would fit the size of the print that you're ordering. And they all kind of depend on the, the ratio of the canvas. Um, so you kind of have to look around in the size options. But this is a nice other option for paper. And I'm really happy with this watercolor paper as well. If you're looking for something ready to hang on your wall right away, you don't have to, to worry about the getting your own frame. Um, maybe something that's a canvas print or the metal art would be really good for you because you don't have to go out and frame it. Um, this one is a one and a half inch wide gallery wrapped canvas. And here's the back of it. I wanna show you the hanging system on here. So it comes with the clips and the wire already on it. And then they send you the little nail to go right in the wall and then it hangs like this. And they've also added these corner pieces so that the piece can lay flat and it doesn't rock and um, doesn't do any damage to the canvas or your wall. So this is one and a half inch gallery wrap. You can also order it in three quarter inch gallery wrap. And it's very, very sturdy. And the colors are very, very, very bright. The canvas has that little bit of canvas texture to it. And it looks very identical to the original piece. So I'm really happy with it. One thing to think about though, when you're ordering a, can a wrapped canvas is you have two choices. You have the mirror image for the sides or you have um, a choice to choose any color to be put printed on all four sides of the canvas. So I chose mirror image on this one. And you can see it takes whatever's in this inch and a half space here and then flips it onto the side. So you kind of get this, this funky little unique mirror image. But what I, what I didn't notice when my daughter noticed right away is, hey mom, you have a fish with two heads on the side here. So if you don't want a two headed fish, then go ahead and pick a solid color and I think it's default to black. So in areas like here and areas on the bottom, it really doesn't matter too much about having the gallery wrap with the mirror edge. But if there's something like an eyeball, just be careful that you might end up with a two-headed fish. Last option is the metal print. And this is a, uh, it's like a semi-gloss. It's printed on a white metal and it's very sturdy and it's very, very light and it's not, uh, chintzy at all because they put a custom um, hanging system on the back. So they've built this bracket. It has the little foam things on the corners again to keep it from rocking. And then the, the hanging system, the wire, the tabs, and then the little nail. So it would hang on your um, wall, something like this. Right? And it's 
it's beautiful. And again, it's a really good option if you don't want to have a, a picture that's framed and um, you want something that's light and maybe it's a unique shape like this long horizontal one. And um, the metal is a really, really neat option. It's sort of a popular kind of trend right So if you have any questions, just shoot me an email um, or message me and I'd be happy to ask answer them for you. All right, bye.